What's going on guys? Justin Henry here with the FanDuel Hurry Up and today we'll be talking about Devontae Adams in this upcoming offseason. Obviously there's a lot going on with the Green Bay Packers organization. Aaron Rodgers may not be coming back. Devontae Adams is a free agent. So let's dissect some potential options if Devontae Adams were to leave the Green Bay Packers this year. Uh, obviously they'd have to make some kind of trade. He might be franchise tagged. So let's just hypothetically talk about these situations and what it would mean for fantasy. The first team I'd be interested in hearing about is the Jacksonville Jaguars. Obviously, there's a lot going on there in Jacksonville with the rebuild. New coach Doug Peterson there. Trevor Lawrence coming off of a, a rookie year where he struggled quite a bit. Uh, but now this team is looking to turn in the right direction and acquiring a receiver like Devontae Adams would really lead the charge for the rebuild of this team. Now, Devontae Adams for fantasy would probably have a little bit of a setback. Obviously, we valued him as a top three wide receiver. Uh, but joining a, a younger quarterback, a new organization, a new offense would obviously want to put the, that tier a little bit back for Devontae Adams, um, but have him still in that wide receiver one conversation. Now, long term, I think this is a great fit for Devontae Adams in his career, pair up with one of the best young QBs in the game, and then also have a chance to, to go with an offensive coach and Doug Peterson. So uh, fit wise, I think this secures his value as a wide receiver one for next season. Dynasty, I think it would take his tier. Uh, keep them in that top five tier. The second fit I want to talk about is the Denver Broncos. Now, the Denver Broncos obviously already have some wide receivers there. Cortland Sutton, Jerry Judy, and their younger receivers. Javante Adams there in the backfield. Noah Fan as a tight end. There's a lot of weapons there for Denver, but they're missing the QB. So this would be contingent on Aaron Rodgers joining Javante Adams there in Denver, which is a potential destination for Aaron Rodgers should he leave the Green Bay Packers. This would obviously be tremendous for his consistency. Devontae Adams' consistency would be locked in with Aaron Rodgers as QB, have the same go-to threat that he, would, he always was in Green Bay, um, but there would be some extra mouths to feed there in Denver. So I would keep him in that top five tier, potentially with the top three upside. The last fit I want to discuss is probably my favorite, the Las Vegas Raiders. Now, the Las Vegas Raiders obviously have a need for a dynamic wide receiver. Hunter Renfro played really well towards the end of last season, and Darren Waller was the de facto wide receiver one for this team most of the early part of the season. Devontae Adams shifting in there would now allow everybody to play their normal roles and also reconnect him with college teammate Derek Carr, who has a familiarity with him. Now, I think this would be an explosive duo. I think that Derek Carr obviously loves to funnel his number one targets, his wide receiver one targets to one player, as we saw Darren Waller and Hunter Renfro do last season. So I think Devontae Adams would be locked in for top three value as long as he was able to stay healthy and on the field. It would be a great fit fantasy-wise and obviously my favorite out of the three if it were to happen. Who's your favorite?